So, Eleanor, about that Armatus Oscar used, was that something the Abbey has been working on for a while? I was never involved in weapons development or anything like that, but I did hear of a secret research division. Word was that they were deciphering ancient scrolls and books coming from every corner of the Empire. Apparently, Teresa knew something of the ancient tongue, and they called her in to help from time to time. Did she work on Enominat's book? I was never privy to any of the details, but I think the books were mostly about controlling Malachim. Well, that Siegfried thing of Zavid's is some kind of power control device, right? The Abbey probably learned about Siegfried in one of those books, and realized they could use it to armatize. So Melchior tracked Zavid down and stole the formula. Makes sense. It was all so they could create the Armatus. Will Eifried be alright? Complete or not, they've seen that they can use the Armatus in battle. They have no use for him anymore. <sighs> Let's get back to Titania, Aizen. I'll help out with the ship. Right. Let's set sail. Urgent message! Let him know that they'll be arriving at Titania within a few hours! So it was you all along, Bien Fu. M miss Mogilu! I'm surprised I didn't sense it. There is a Gesh on you, interfering with our pact. <laughs> well played, Melchior. Impressive. That old man must have planned all of this from the very moment you escaped me. Even my imprisonment in Titania and my encounter with Velvet. All calculated down to the minute. Huh, nice. F forgive me, Miss Mogilu. There was no way I could fight against Lord Melchior's arts. Uh, I don't care. I don't care about anything. And I don't care that I don't. We were listening. We heard it all. Ugh, oh, boring. Fine then, do with us what you will. It's not like I trusted you to begin with. Spy or no spy, this was inevitable. Besides, you're not sorry. Make yourself useful and fight for us. <sighs> you're good at this cruelty that's also compassion thing, aren't you? I just don't have the time to deal with you two. After this whole business is over with? <laughs> <laughs> 
I'll devour you, if that's what you want. Hey, Velvet. Tell me, what does it feel like to... hate? Does it torment you? Is it agony? Does the searing fire of your hatred empower you to feel? Does it give your life meaning where there was none? <laughs> Land ho! Titania! There's an Abbey ship in the front docks! Take us around back! If you want your answer, fight by my side. You'll see it the very moment I kill Artorius. In the face of doom, still the crow caws defiantly. <laughs> you really know how to vex me. So, you're using the Forbidden Arts. This has to be Melchior's doing. the one you want! The Lord of Calamity. That again? What a melodramatic name. It's what you're called by the scores of citizens whose lives you've ruined. Face the enormity of your sins. What idiocy. Huh. We'll carve the weight of your sin from your flesh! We are the wings of the Divine Will! <sighs> As expected. themselves just as I expected the Abbey they know exactly what they're doing grimoire where are the Therians couldn't tell you they came out of nowhere and before I knew it we were all split up how's the book nearly done but I'm still working on the critical passages at the very end all of you, get on board the Von Eltia. I'll find the Therians. Oh? You really think we can make it past a horde of armatized exorcists? Stay behind. I don't care. Ugh. Don't touch that! You don't have to do this alone. We're all in this together. And I promise... I promise I'll protect you, Velvet. You'll protect me. Long ago, Lothi said the same thing. But that sort of idealistic drivel will kill you. 
make your worthless promises. They won't change reality. Look what happened to Luffy. Dead. Murdered. And I... I couldn't protect him either. In the end, no matter how much he cared for me, my only brother, he... His life torn away from him. Oh, it must have hurt. Velvet. You worry about yourself, Luffy said. That's an order. An... an order. We have to keep Inominat out of the picture. So that I can kill Artorius. Let's go! We'll push the enemy back and keep an eye out for the Therian. I know this isn't the best time, but I have something to say. Please forgive me. I've been a spy for Lord Melchior. You were the one telling the Abbey about us? Yes, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Melchior is a clever one, isn't he? Planting his spy right next to Magilu. After all, a forest is the best place to hide a tree. Melchior used his arts to place orders on Bienfu that overrode Magilu's pact. <sighs> that son of a dog. <laughs> Please don't hate me! I meant Melchior, not you. Really? Exerting control over someone else's life goes against everything Aizen stands for. We know you were forced to do it against your will. But my spying put everyone in serious danger! That's still a fact! The Bloodwings also knew what we were up to. The Abbey would have figured it out with or without you. What'd you tell them, anyway? Um, uh, that Velvet is actually pretty good wife material? And what fishing rods Aizen prefers? And what Miss Mogulu says in her sleep? And how fast Dial's tail regrows? What? That's what you told them? It's done. Pay it no more heed. But things must be set aright. Aright? How? Eleanor, I apologize for suspecting you. I'm sorry. Aizen! That's right! I must apologize as well! I'm deeply sorry, Lady Eleanor! Very well. Apologies accepted all around. Are exorcists using armatization aware that it could cost them their lives? I'm sure they are. If I were still with the Abbey... I would likely be using an Armatus too. Endangering one's own life in order to save the many? It's the logical choice. But using something that dangerous so frequently in battle is absolutely wrong. The Abbey must be starting to feel the pressure too. Even so, the losses are unacceptably high. That's how badly they want the Therians, and how big a threat we represent. Or it could be that it has nothing to do with us and the real point is to test their new weapon. That can't be. It's all an experiment? A blade proves its true worth by making it through battle unbroken. Are exorcists all that different? Your logic is sound, but it's still awful. We were able to survive this time, but it won't be much longer until they've perfected the armatization. That's not the only thing we need to worry about where ticking clocks are concerned. Am I wrong? Velvet. It doesn't matter. We kill whoever gets in our way. You're strong, but I'm strong.
Aren't spears difficult weapons to master? I trained with them for many years. Many years, huh? Tougher than I would have liked. Are you ready for this?
All right. Show them how I free. First they robbed the Malachim of their will, and now their bodies, too. Makes me sick. But still, it fits their reason. They want strength, and no art can squeeze strength from a Moloch like that We will need one. to be extremely wary. See why someone would gamble his life to wield it. They're dying. All of them. Mere tools. Thank <laughs> you. 
So, you all got away. It was all I could do to flee. I have lost face. You don't have a face! Uh, I was so scared! It's okay now, dear. I won't let them cause you any more pain. Medissa was the one who saved us! Thank you. I could never forgive them for involving children. That's all. Kuragane, head to the rear docks. Keep them safe. If you find the Prince and Griffin, take the Von Altia and escape. As you wish. Rokuro, take the Storm Quell. I made it with the Orichalcum you gave me. You actually did it? I abandoned all desire and forged it with a clear mind. You will find no harder sword in all the world. Storm Quell, made from Orichalcum. I'll use it well, Kurogane. Blade, Storm Quell. It's the hardest blade the world has ever known. Even to an untrained eye, that sword is obviously something special. Kurogane is a real master. Color me amazed. The God Blade Storm Howl versus the Orichalcum Storm Quell. This will be something to see. Will it end in triumph, or will you need to try more oomph? The gods alone know. The gods have nothing to do with it. Skill alone will determine who lives and who dies. Managed to avoid capture, huh, Prince? As did you. You did well to avoid Artorius and his forces. Lord Artorius is here? He is. I overheard some exorcists mention it. Artorius? If you want to die, do it alone. We're saving the Therians before anything else. Besides, we're so close to deciphering the ancient book. I know. We'll escape from the rear docks. Follow me. Watch out, Princey Wincy. You ain't no Therian. If Griffin gets there first, we're leaving you behind. Uh, understood. Let's go! 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 Let's go!
here! Take a look at this. Show us your determination. Well done! I'd expect no less from Eifrit's crew. Alright. Show him how I freed. Torius use an Armatus as well? I don't know. It's hard to believe that the Abbey's leader would risk using an art that could end his own life, but... The Shepherd's reputation would be ruined if he self-destructed over some botched formula. On the other hand, if the risk is based on the user's ability, then the Legates might not have any trouble. So if Artorius were to try, he'd Armatize with Inominat. Can an Empyrean be used as an Armatus? I'm not even sure Artorius can handle that. He'll do it. Why else would he try to revive Inominat? But we're talking about an Empyrean! He'll succeed. I'm certain of it. This is the Shepherd Artorius we're talking about here. Whether God or Devil stands in his way, he won't be swayed. That's who he is. Velvet! But it won't save him. He'll die by my hand. Empyrean or no Empyrean.
Eisen, there's trouble. The enemy found the Von Eltia. Several enemy ships are heading this way right now. Set sail, now! I'm, uh, glad we were able to save everyone. There's no escape, Lord of Calamity! Benwick! Forget me! Take the Von Altia and leave! Now! That's madness! What do you think you're doing? If I don't take them down, they'll sink you from afar! Raise anchor! We'll make it through somehow! Aye, aye. But don't die. You hear me? Crazy kids. We're not going to die. We're going to kill. Head to the front docks. To steal an Abbey ship, I take it. That's where the Abbey's main forces will be concentrated. And Lord Artoria should be there too. All the better. But we still don't have a way to fight Inomina. I told you, if you want to die, do it alone. I'm not asking you to come with me. Use me. Percival. Don't worry. Griffin got away. If you use me as a hostage, you should be able to steal a ship. I owe you one for this. But don't expect gratitude. I don't. Looks like this is our best and only bet. Going to the front docks to escape. Don't forget that. I know. Arthur's first maxim, right? About this whole hostage thing, you mean? Yeah, that too, but Velvet's acting really strange. And that's unusual how? Moggy Lou! Yelling at me won't change anything. Her thirst for blood knows no bounds, and she's got all the self-control of a wounded beast. With the way she's acting, I'm not sure she'll be able to escape. She's cut her way through all her problems before. She can do it again. 
I hope so. But everything has its limits. There's no blade that will not break. Nor is there such a heart. When the time comes, you'll need to make a decision. It's best you start figuring it out now. When the time comes... We will need to be extremely wary. Sorry to catch you down. Phew. Well, looks like we shook off our pursuit. Of course we did. This is the Von Eltia. No. It can't be. This is terrible. Turn back, now! What? There's no way we can do that. I finally deciphered the last part of the book. If what it says is true, then you know me not is already. The coast is clear. All right, let's make a break for the docks. You're running. It's Lord Artorius, and... Sigurai! No, stop! Please, now's the time to negotiate for safe passage. Step back, your highness. The girl before you wants nothing other than to kill me. You better believe it! <laughs> this is a trap. We're leaving. Let me go! I have to save her! That ain't gonna happen, kid. Don't forget, you're my ticket out of here, too. I'm not your tool! <laughs> Try to stop me and I'll take you down! Even you, Aizen! Your Armatus isn't gonna stop me! Don't worry. I have another trick up my sleeve. <laughs> that sword. Is that or a Calcum? Good job, little bro. Never seen that before. Damn right! The hardest sword there is! It may be made of or a Calcum. Stand down, Shigeru. Don't be a spoil sport. I'm just starting to have fun. Get caught in the middle of this, and even you won't survive unscathed. The one to face Velvet will be a Nomenot. Did you miss me? Luffy! Velvet's brother? So that's his game. That's right. I am Lafayette Crow. And more. I am also Empyrean Inominat, the Suppressor. No. That's... Inominat? 
If you're gonna do this, you gotta commit. He's our enemy. I know! This is just... just another illusion! I'll devour all of you! Elements of creation, gather! Velvet, that's what you've been doing this whole time. Struggling against all reason. Shut up! Don't you dare! Pretend to be my brother! Your struggles are over. All your pain, your suffering. I'll end all of it for you. 